So hi you guys. Today I'm going to take y'all with me. I have to go up to the makeup studio to clean up a little bit, put some little supplies and stuff up and I have to clean out my fountain. I'm so excited to show y'all my fountain. Y'all, it's a DIY fountain and I'm gonna link all of the Amazon finds in the description box for y'all because yeah. My fountain is like super dirty because my filter stopped working. I have to put my new filter in that I ordered from Amazon. So yeah, that's what we are going to do today to go ahead and get some stuff done. But I'm gonna curl my hair. Just give my hair a little, mm, just a little something, something. We gotta look right before we go out the house. I already did my skincare and you know, got myself prepared hygiene wise. So now I just have to fix my hair and we will be out of the door. I got my curlers. I love these curlers. It gets super hot fast. But yeah. My rocks in my fil in my fountain is like super dirty. I don't know if it's fungus. I mean not fungus. Whatever it's called. Fun fungi. Fungus. Y'all know what I'm talking about. The little green stuff that it kinda like collects like when you're having like fish tanks. Is it fungus? Is it fungus? But I just know my fountain is super dirty and I have to get my fountain back running at work. It helps me relax when I am doing makeup on my clients. And it makes them relax too. They be falling asleep and stuff, y'all. I noticed that like when my fountain is not, since my fountain has not been running, the vibes is not as they should be. Try to help them, you know, be comfortable in my space. The struggle of trying to do your own hair be, be real, like, I know how to do my hair, but it be a struggle sometimes. I can curl my hair with flat iron really good, but these things, it's so annoying when it gets like trapped in the barrel. I'm gonna go no makeup today. Just lashes and just a little lip lip. Nothing too dramatic. Uh, just the part that I hate. I'm trying to get the hair out of the barrel. Any tips? It's just not going to get it. <laughs> Look at this. I know that ain't. That is not how you curl hair. I know y'all like, that is not how you curl hair. Baby, it's going to be curled. Watch. What the freak? It's a given job. That's all I want is just a little body. I gotta show y'all my, my new sign too that my brother made. He did an absolute wonderful job. But my name sign, like my name is IB Janelle. So they be like, how you pronounce your name? Like I joined a live on Instagram. They be like, how do you pronounce it? Is it Janelle? Jan Janelle? No, it's Janelle. Kind of like Chanel, but with a J. So, Janelle. Not Janelle. Not Janelle. Janelle. Any of y'all ever seen the seat filler? Kelly Rowland played as Janelle. I absolutely love that movie because it is so funny. He tried to play a girl. He played like he was this rich guy. It hurt her because, like, you didn't have to lie. One scene was like they was, they was outside of the phone booth. He was calling her from the phone booth outside. His friend got on the phone and was like, yo, can I speak to Janelle? She said, hello. He fainted. He was like, she sound fine on the phone. She sound fine on the phone. <laughs> and a helicopter came across. She was like, what is that noise? He was like, oh, that's just my, that's just the 75 inch uh, theater in my house. <laughs> but let me go get my opinion. Just go with some plain Jane joggers, right? the fit body suit of course i'm gonna put a jacket on put my little bracelet on 
Give myself a little accessory. Put it on my wrist. Bam. And of course, throw on a little fragrance. Can't go wrong with the Miss Dior. Little AS, ASMR. <laughs> Just a little bit, Reese. Cause this stuff can get extremely strong. I look good, I look good. Lip gloss. So this is the J-Cat Beauty Lips. The girl is wearing rubber bands. So I have to stick them right here on this little hook. Right? On the hook. So for my jacket, I'm just gonna throw on this gray hoodie. I got this from Los Angeles. I absolutely love this this thing, y'all. It might not go with my joggers, I don't think. It's gonna have to work. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The struggle be me. Sounds like... <sighs> Gina, baby. Hello? Oh, it's awesome. Gina. Damn. Hello? Baby? Hello? Hey, was on white cheeks. Throw on my shoe, and we ready. <laughs> so this right here is all of my goodies that I have to take to the studio. This is a new makeup mirror. Like, um, it opens up. I absolutely love this. This was a gift for Christmas from my boyfriend. I can't open it right now, but the, the mirror is open, but I have to take this to the studio so yeah i'm gonna get all this stuff in the car and i will see y'all in the car in the car <laughs> okay guys so i got all my stuff in the car i had to get somebody to help me carry the mirror look at my fingers Ooh, them things hurt the mirror is no joke okay but i got my stuff back there that is my old sign but my main goal is to put my acrylic wall shelves up that I found on Amazon. They are actually some nail polish uh, racks, but it works perfect for my foundations. I stuck my foundation in it last night to see if it fit. And it fit. So, girl, I'm excited. I wonder if I could put some fish in my fountain. I go to Pet Smart and buy like some little beta fish. And just had them swimming around in there. I think that'll be so cute. But yeah, so that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna head to the studio. Okay, y'all, so we have made it to the studio. I'm so excited to let y'all see my fountain. Like, yes. I got my new pump. I'm so excited about it. It's going to be flowing with water again. If you do not have an indoor fountain, get you one. You're going to love it. Like, it's going gonna, it's gonna to relax you and relieve stress. We all need a good stress reliever. Okay, so here we are. And oh my gosh, my fountain is like super yucky. I might have to get some gloves, y'all. Because I'm gonna let y'all see how I clean it. Ew. See my pump? It doesn't work. And all the water just kind of like evaporated. I should have got some new rocks. This is the bamboo thing that I was telling y'all about. She is so dusty. Like, I've been away from the studio, y'all, because I was sick. 
and I didn't want to get nobody else sick, so. But I'm feeling a lot better now. And this is probably my favorite piece of the fountain. Of course, this is a, a metal pot. Got a candle right here. This is a fountain. And you just plug it up in the wall. All of this I decorated myself and kind of pieced together. As you can see, the only thing I did was, yeah, pieced everything and decorated it how I wanted it to look. That's what we're going to be doing today. I'm going to be cleaning this out and I'm going to let y'all see how I clean that out.
This has been a day, y'all. Literally. I got the mirror up, cleaned up, put the foundation on, I put lashes, and decided to paint this border. And we are going to put this picture up there. So, yeah, I'll be back on here to show y'all what the room looks like when I sleep and clean up everything and put the picture up. So, yeah. Okay, y'all, so that concludes my vlog for today. Ooh, it's no way. It's dark outside. There's no way that I just did that all day. And it got to the point where they was gonna help me hang the pictures that I showed y'all, the art the art pictures on the wall. But they were taking too long, so I hung it myself with some command strips. I'm hungry. I gotta get into bed. I have not been asleep since last night. I stayed up, y'all. Like, I was just like, I had so much to do, but Thank y'all so much for tuning into this vlog. I will see y'all in my next video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Cause yes, day in the life of a makeup artist part one slash clean up with me. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'll see y'all later. Bye.